Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my Daily Stock Signals video for Friday the 11th of May. And as usual on a Friday, I pick a potential long off the weekly time frame for a fifth wave move, so a longer term swing. Um, but our members do get daily signals to download uh, for the weekly, the daily and the 60 minute time frame, both long and short for the fifth wave and stochastics. So for the longs for today, it's very simple, 11th of May, click on the image and they download the spreadsheet for today. So let's have a look at the spreadsheet. So for the weekly, I've chosen top of the line here, Citigroup C for today. These are the rest of the potential fifth wave trade setting up uh, on the weekly time frame. But I've chosen Citigroup. It's been there for a few weeks now and just started to move away. So I'm quite interested in um, investing in this stock. So let's have a look at the chart. So first of all, this is the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from Wave5Trade.com for the Ninja Trader NT8 platform, but it is available for Thinkorswim, TradeStation and Multicharts. Um, for those users that have got the Indicator Suite, I've isolated the start of this trend quite sensibly around about February 2016 at these lows. And then our uh, software has automated the uh, Elliott Wave count giving it a one, a two, a three, and we've had this wave four pullback right now. So um, just for the stock signals membership, we get those basic filters. We start that we've got a wave four pullback against the main trend. We have got a pullback that has the 535 oscillator between the 90 and the 140%, which you can see down here, which it is. And the stochastic has also pulled back, crossed over in the oversold zone against a main bullish trend, as you can see by these yellow dots, which are part of our indicator, denoting a very strong bullish trend there. So let's have a closer look at this fourth wave pullback and look to set the trade or investment up. So first of all, the wave force pulled back into our green probability zone. So this is part of our indicator suite that gives us an 85% probability. It's going to go on and make a new wave five high into our automated target zone around about $86 here up here in the blue. So the, the entry strategy is very simple. Again, once we found support on this wave four pullback, the fifth wave is the highest probability move in this trend. It's not the sexiest. It's not the strongest impulse move, but it's the highest probability because all the other rules and observations have been met. So we've had a great wave one, two, a big strong wave three. We've had some profit taken on the wave four with 535. The stochastics crossed over, got a great support zone and we're just looking for an entry to go long. So. I've decided on the entry at 73.53, which is just on the limit of the 6.4 moving average high, which is part of our indicator suite here. So this is the average of the last six uh, weeks uh, highs, and then it's skewed over four days in advance to give us some entry points. Also, I must be aware of this previous rejection at this high here which was uh, 73.38. So I want to be above there as well, because that's a decision point in which traders decided they were going to sell off and it came back down and made this double bottom here with this other wave for low. So this week so far has been a really strong week for Citigroup. We are near the highs of the week and I just want to put this on just in case we get through that 73.53 entry this week. If it doesn't, we've got a good entry next week because it's way outside the 64 moving average high. The stop loss is uh, just below the wave four here. The wave four low is 66.55. So we need a 66.45 stop loss there. And then the target's around about 86, 85 dollars, something like that. So as you can see, the risk to reward is one to 1.6 into our target zone there, which gives us a really good, uh, strong potential. Now, this is off the weekly time frame, remember, for Citigroup. So we could see this taking anywhere from nine to 20 weeks to hit that target, depending on uh, how the markets are behaving, uh, whether, you know, forget this volatility that we've had just recently, it could take longer than nine weeks um, because that volatility could subdue 
that uh, bullish momentum that seems to be in Citigroup very strong longer term. So for me, this is a physical stocks buy. Um, for trading this off options, you're going to be looking at least 20 weeks ahead for your options expiry. So that's it for today for this uh, stock setup from the Signals membership using the Wave 5 Trade Elliott Wave Indicator Suite on Citigroup on the weekly time frame. Have a great trading day and a great weekend.